What's good, everybody? We're back with another Call of Duty mobile reaction video. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day today. Uh, you guys might notice there's something that hasn't been in my videos previously. It's right here. That's actually the Bobby Talk sign for the new show that I am hosting over on the Call of Duty mobile esports channel. First episode is actually up, so if you guys want to go check it out, make sure you go do that. We're with Noah and Godsley having some fun talking about esports and that type of thing. So, Really enjoyed it. Looking forward to the future episodes. Talking about what we're actually going to be going through today, though. We do have the new test server here for Call of Duty Mobile Season 4. And with that, some new features that we're definitely excited to look at. So we're just going to take a quick run through. I'm not going to do any in-depth gameplay. We do also have a new side camera. I'm still trying to figure out like what the best angle for the side camera is. Uh, if you have any recommendations, let me know. But... Anyway, we do have the test server downloaded. Obviously, I am Tribe Iferg. Who else would I be? I got the leaving rank match penalty because they make you play through the tutorial 27 million times every time you go into the test server. It's a lot of fun. But anyways, we've got a lot of new things that have been added. So number one, those of you who follow me on Twitter actually probably already saw this. But I had talked a while ago, about a month ago, about wanting some type of a feature where we can basically send like battle passes skin cp to our friends rather than having to do it via gift cards and giveaways like that and it looks like call of duty mobile is actually implementing that right now now that's not to say that we weren't working on this already but given that nobody else has talked about it i'm gonna take uh full responsibility for the idea and full credit uh, anyways, excited for that. That's going to make Battle Pass giveaways a lot easier, so definitely keep an eye out for that. We do also have a couple new things added over in multiplayer, so one thing you guys are going to see, I believe, yeah, the new dome map. Um, I think we can actually play it, so we'll hop into it. I know a couple other YouTubers have already done gameplay for it, but I just want to walk around it because I have not played a lot of Call of Duties in the past, so I've never actually played this before. Um, definitely looks like a really sick map. I'm liking the vibes of it. Um, maybe a little bit of a, a scrapyard type feel, especially with the way that the flags are formatted, but looks super, super sick. We'll run around it real quick just to get a feel for it, and <sighs> definitely big-time scrapyard Alpha. vibes. We're capturing Bravo. Um, yep, obviously I do still have the default HUD. What, were there numbers I just saw pop up on the screen? Lost the lead. What, what was that? Uh, playing Thumbs default HUD on the iPad Pro. Okay, maybe, maybe I'm tripping. I don't know what it was. Definitely looks like a cool map, though. Uh, I'm excited for this one. Hopefully, it, it looks like a massive map. So, hopefully big enough and competitive enough to be able to be a ranked map. Obviously, I don't really know a whole lot, but it looks like we got a whole lot of side spots, everything else. Looking forward to this one coming to the game. We're going to go ahead and hop out so that we can look at some of the other new features that we do have coming to the game. Taking a look at our loadouts. I believe we do actually have a hint at the new gun coming. Okay, so it's not right there. I might have to go to Twitter for this one because Murder Blast tweeted out. I'm not really sure how he found it. Wait. Oh, that's the PP-19. Dang it. Got my hopes up right there. Okay, so it's not here. Um, we will take a look at the perks real quick, see if we got anything new here. So nothing over on the reds. Over on the greens, we have gung-ho. So hip fire your weapon, throw grenades, and change ammo while sprinting. That feels incredibly strong. You can hip fire while sprinting? Like imagine the <laughs> Imagine the QQ not oh my gosh. That's going to be crazy. I, I bet Hitman's going to love this one for his Candid Hit Fire series. I think he's going to have an absolute blast with that one. That feels like it's going to be crazy good. I could be wrong on that one, but that just sounds really, really strong. Um, I don't know if that's one that's been in past Call of Duties or not. We do also have the Hawk X3, a drone that can be controlled manually using a machine gun as a weapon. We also have the K9 unit coming to the game. So a couple new score streaks to keep an eye out for. As far as melee weapons go, I don't think we have anything. Uh, oh, this is just the... Oh, it's the actual model for the Renetti. So this is the gun that's coming to the game pretty soon, sometime during the season. We don't know exactly when that's going to be, but it is going to be a burst fire pistol. So looking forward to that one. 
nothing over on the character skin side of the game in regards to uh, tacticals, nothing there in regards to lethals, nothing there. So not really a ton of stuff it's looking like in coming to the game right now. Looking at Battle Royale classes, we've got, oh, Traveler. Um, so it doesn't say anything about the Traveler class, but it definitely looks like there is another class. I mean, we, we typically get a new class every season of Battle Royale, so, or every season of Call of Duty Mobile, I guess is what I'm trying to say. And I am going to go ahead and pull up the leak from Murder Blast right here. So, uh, it's a new LMG found in the game files. You guys are going to see the Holger LMG, it looks like, is coming to the game. Go ahead and full screen this. Uh, oh, wow. That's very low resolution. He, I know he has a higher resolution uh, version of it. Oh, it looks like it's actually going to get a Mythic. Uh, so the Holger 26, for those of you who don't know, it's an LMG. I believe it is a Modern Warfare LMG, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and apparently we have a Ghost legendary skin coming to the game that might be the first legendary skin that i like actually want to get that's definitely really really exciting but yeah the holger 26 it looks like is going to be the next lmg coming to the game we'll go ahead and look up a screenshot of it just because some of you probably don't know what it looks like but this is the holger um, it's not really, I don't think it's ever been a meta LMG in Modern Warfare or Warzone, but PP-19's never really been a meta gun in any other game, and it's absolutely dominant. Obviously, the, the Bullfrog's a decent option in Warzone, but, uh, the PP-19, as the actual PP-19, has never been crazy good. So I'm looking forward to all the new stuff that we do have coming to the game. I think that covers the majority of stuff that we could potentially look at in here. Um, maybe like a slightly different format for inviting people. It's a, It looks like it might be collapsible for that. Um, oh, I forgot to look at the... Okay, so that's what I thought. It looks like the Hawk X3 is actually a score streak, and they like accidentally placed it in the operator skills department. Um, that's just a sideways drone, if I'm not mistaken, right? Yeah, that's just a sideways drone, so probably just a placeholder for the time being. Obviously, we never get to see the new uh, rank rewards or the new battle pass or anything like that. Um, and I don't think we'll have any type of a sneak peek over here in the arsenal either. Looks like it's only going to let us see the DLQ holidays. I think I had heard something about... Um, we're going to name our clan the Bobbers. Something about Clan Wars... Um, Guild War main entrance. That's big. That's, all right, so it looks like Clan Wars are going to be coming to Call of Duty Mobile. I don't know what that's going to mean, but that definitely means I got to step up the game for my clan, so I guess we're going to be doing clan trials today. But that's going to be it for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, please do me a huge favor. Wait, shop? Okay, it looks like there is going to be a shop. Okay, yeah, this is something we got to get on the ball with because my clan's lacking behind a lot. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.